Okay, so we have Chiron, the wounded healer planet, retrograde from the 19th of July until the 23rd of December. So that means that your emotions could be heightened at the moment, that wounds from the past could be coming to surface. Now, Chiron is the planet of the wounded healer. When it is in retrograde, it means that it gives you a second chance to go back over things to be able to heal things, okay? Now it's in Aries, and this is all about yourself. So this is a really, really good time to accept the past. You can't change things, you can only change the way that you behave from the past. So this is a good time to accept wounds of the past and how that you are dealing with them. It's a good time to forgive the past, to forgive yourself, to forgive those that have hurt you. This is a good time to heal your inner child, to go back to perhaps childhood memories that might have caused you some trauma there and to accept them, to embrace them, to understand how those of a negative attribute have now become a positive for you. How have you made something that went wrong or that was a trauma turn into a positive into your life? This is a really good time to accept things that you cannot change. This is a time where you want to be going back over your wounds in order to heal for your future. Try not to let the past mistakes or past hurts affect your future. This is about acknowledging things, this is about um, coming into your own power. Now, it is a wonderful healing time, even though it could be quite emotional for you. So it is the perfect time to heal those wounds from the past there. And show that you can live now in harmony, accepting what's happened, moving forward with what's happened and living in harmony with it. Accepting your part in those wounds. Not to say that you were to blame, but to accept that your soul went through that. And as a result of that, you are the person that you are today. Now, if you're in a good position with yourself, if you're happy with where you are today, that is only a positive that's come from that. If you're battling with yourself, if you're finding that you can't move on from things from the past, then this is suffocating your future. So now's the time to find a way of accepting it is what it is, to embrace it and almost use that wound as a portal to open things up that can really benefit you for your future. Now there's some things to do on a soul level here that makes things a little bit more acceptable. Sometimes when we think about the person hurting us, we find it difficult because human to human. But when we experience our soul's learning, our soul's growth, that can allow us to accept what our soul had to go through in order to heal. So use these next few months up until December, go over old ground, but this time use it for healing.